What's up everybody, Silver here with another Halo 5 Guardians Achievement Guide. This time we're doing part 9 of Hunt the Truth, which is to find and claim all of the intel throughout all of the campaign levels. So start up Mission 9, this is Alliance. And this is one of the missions where you don't have to actually fight anybody, you just walk around and talk to people. But for the first one, you want to turn around immediately when you spawn into the map, and it's just behind you by that big caved-in keyhole doorway thing. So then move your way through, there's going to be a bunch of these umbrellas. The first one on your right, I'm kind of under it right now. You're going to climb up and onto it, and we're going to climb up onto a pillar from there. So we're up on this umbrella looking thing, and we are going to jump onto this rubble here. And then we'll jump up onto this little section. It's kind of a tricky jump, not too bad, but just get onto that little nub sticking out. And then you could use your Artemis tracking system, and it will highlight it for you if you're near it. So that is the second one. The next one here is the umbrella again to the right. I'm running under it again. There it is, and we are just going to continue this way. And you can see a doorway over on the right here. So we're going to go in here, and here will be number three. You can do these in any order, and you can also do it on any difficulty, though it doesn't really matter what difficulty you're on, because uh, this level, there's no enemies again. So do it on Legendary if you want. It doesn't matter. But that is the third one. The next one, I'm looking at that umbrella again, and now I'm turning around and just walking. Use the Artemis tracking system if you want. It will highlight it right here on this little platform and scan that one. That is number four out of eight. Uh, this next one is behind Dr. Halsey, so find her. She's kind of at that little platform over there that I'm looking at, but it's right behind her all the way in the back here. So it is over here, sitting on this box. So pick that one up. That's number five. Again, you can do these in any order. Uh, it doesn't really matter at all. And the next one is all the way over here. I'll just, uh, you know, keep it with the same clip. So after getting that data pad behind Halsey, just follow this path. We're going to go over to two elites who are talking up on a ledge. Uh, there's a bunch of elites talking throughout this level, but these ones are kind of high up. They're over here to the left. You can see them hanging out, and the data pad is right here to my right. So scan that one. Again, if you're having trouble finding exactly where they are, use the Artemis tracking system, and it will highlight them for you. And after that one, we're going to get up on top of this ledge and go up on this pillar. It's kind of collapsed and up against the wall here. So climb up this, and it's kind of a tough jump, not too tough, but a little uh, a little daunting. It doesn't seem like you can make this jump, right off the bat at least. At least I didn't think you could do it. I was kind of psyching myself up there to do it, but you could. Just make sure you use that thruster pack to close the gap, and it's right on top of the pillar here. And that is number seven. The eighth one is very easy to get. It is right in the back of the pelican, or towards the back of the pelican. You can see the pelican's down here. Spartan Palmer is in there. Not exactly in the pelican, but behind it, and the last piece of intel is right here. So that is it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys later for more Halo achievements and part 10 of this little series, Enemy Lines.